What's up guys, Jason Messi here and welcome to a brand new mini series. This could be my top 5 and today we're starting off with my top 5 FIFA 12 squad builders. This will be going through my old videos from the past and uh, it's going to take a look back so some of you may remember the videos themselves or if you are new it takes you back to how I pretty much started guys. So if you can smash 1,500 likes right now I will do a FIFA 13 version of this uh, probably sometime next week and as always if you're looking to buy some ultimate team coins then go check out the FIFA shop.co.uk links will be down below in the description and make sure to use the discount code of MESSI10 to get your 5% discount on all purchases. And finally, before you do start, let me know in the comments below who your favourite FIFA 12 player was and why. So then starting things off then at number 5, we're going with a very, very nice looking team actually. And uh, it won't all be synced up guys as um, obviously these, these videos are pre-recorded. And uh, yeah, the team features two man of the match cards. As you see, the man of the match Kaka, which was a very, very first ever one. And also a man of the match Falcao. A cheeky Messi up front, uh, a couple of informs such as Ronaldo. And also a blue uh, team of the year, I think it's most consistent, Alexis Sanchez. So that team was really, really solid. And uh, it's 87 overall, including the bench. Really, really nice. And... I'm pretty sure that must have cost an absolute shit ton. So uh, that is be my number five. And uh, simply the fact that it's the players that it features like Messi, Ronaldo and Falcao. Um, not necessarily played the best, but it was a still a very, very solid squad. And I know it is all Liga BBVA, but like I said before, it is because of the players that it features. And uh, yeah, that, that's a night partnership with Pepe and Ramos was something else. Moving swiftly on then to number four. And this one is to be actually a skill squad. And this was one of my favourite by an absolute mile. And this is the 4 treble 2 formation before they enter there and give us the new coloured links. And it was so easy to make a hybrid with this formation. Simply the fact that the chemistry was really easy to get anyway. And if you had green links, it was, like I said, really, really easy to get. So our front two strikers were their Silver El Shirawi, five star skill moves, and Neymar, five star skill moves. They also got Wallace in there when he was gold, and an informed Giovinco. The team overall, though, features uh, four five star skillers and a cheeky four star skill right back being Cicinho. But overall, the team was absolutely superb. The amount of times I abused that Opara and uh, uh, Marvel win centre back link was unbelievable. And also, that was the upgraded Felipe Bastos to firm right at centre defensive mid. An overall absolute tank and uh, definitely, it was so, so cheap as well. And lastly, for this squad, Neymar actually only sent me back 9,000 coins. So compare that price to now, uh, that's pretty damn cheap. On to number three, and as you can see, this features more skillers, and uh, I'm not going to lie, I tried skill a lot on FIFA 12, and I wasn't too bad at it. Of course, on FIFA 14, I'm not too great. That's in fact that skilling's kind of gone out of the game a little bit, in my opinion. But overall, the team isn't a great hybrid whatsoever. It's pretty much just Brazil and Syria. Uh, but that El Shirari and Robinho, Marias midfield, oh my god, it was godly. Some of the long shots you could score with them, and of course the skill runs. Uh, I think, wait, the front three are all five-star skillers, and they're obviously the whole midfield, so six. And also we've got Marcia Azevedo, who was also a five-star skiller. So seven five-star skillers in one squad. That was pretty damn nice. It wasn't too expensive either. Uh, I'm talking like 300k, and uh, that Abate right back, again, was uh, another spicy player. Moving on then, on to number two, and this was one of my retro squad builders from about nine months ago, before FIFA 13 actually ended, and uh, this team holy shit it's got a lot of blues in there it's got a lot of purples and it's also got that in for Muller but it is one expensive squad we've got that team the Messi we have got that international man of the match at Cristiano Ronaldo but we've also got a uh, a pretty tasty defense being there team the bad stubber unfortunately now uh, always injured or actually got a big injury and also that international man of the match Hummels uh, that Ramos again they weren't the highest rate the purple cards but they were so damn nice to look at. We will be getting them for the World Cup, hopefully. And uh, that, that trio out front, Benzema, Messi and Ozil, was uh, pretty damn nice. The bench, on the other hand, isn't too bad. I've actually seen 91 rated down to some more international round match cards and an informed Templeton. So then, up to the number one spot. And this... Overall doesn't look the best squad, but this was my absolute favourite squad that I've ever used on FIFA 12 and potentially FIFA 13 and 14 as well. And that is going to be my skill team with a lot of Belgians in there, a, 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 a basically Brazilian. It's a really, really nice squad and I tried recreating on FIFA 14, but unfortunately you can't because of positions and chemistry and stuff. But overall the team... Oh my god, it had, uh, obviously, Morales second in form left wing was pretty much Ronaldo. Got that for Facilius, five-star skill striker, can't ask for much more. Then we've got Dalinho when he's uh, five-star skill, Marais five-star skill. That blue hazard was something else. And also, I'm going to quickly try and find the stats of that Vatonio there. One second, guys. So, he had 82 pace, 86 shooting, 81 passing, 91 defending, and 88 heading, and 73 dribbling on a blue uh, centre-back card. So, that is the reason I really, really like that, uh, that pretty much that team, guys. 
So in the background right now, you'll be seeing some gameplay from this squad in particular, as uh, I thought it was probably worthy of me showing some gameplay with the actual team itself. So the team and uh, the video, guys, I uh, hope you have enjoyed it. Let, uh, let me know in the comments below if you have. And also smash that like button if you want me to do a FIFA 13 version of this, as I'll happily do it. As I made some pretty tasty teams on FIFA 13. And uh, also remember to check out the FIFA shop for your ultimate team coin needs. If you actually make a purchase from them, you'll be entered into a raffle to uh, win 1 million coins every single week. So some really, really nice stuff from their part, guys. And also, uh, yeah, also let me know in the comments below what player you liked on FIFA, uh, FIFA 12 the most and why you liked them in particular. So mine was probably El Shirawi because that, that five-star skill, five-star weak foot, can't say much more in a silver, guy. So like I said, I do hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to subscribe if you are new around here and I will see you guys next time.